Project Accounting Overview. Acumatica's Project Accounting Suite delivers real-time profitability and flexible billing for individual projects. This is ideal for professional service companies, service industries, and other businesses that track job costs against a budget. Acumatica projects consist of multiple tasks. Each task can have unique billing rules, recurring charges, and budgets. The task budgets roll up to the project-level budget for a complete view. Projects can be assigned employees, billing terms, and user-defined variables called attributes. Project templates make creating a new project easy. In this case, I have created a project with both fixed price billing and time and material billing. I have used my project attributes in my billing calculations, so I assign values to them. The Project Balances tab shows me the expected results of my project, while the Employees tab shows individuals who are assigned to work on this project. As the project progresses, my Budget, Activities, and Invoices tab will be updated to reflect the current state of my project. During this project, various expenses that are released to my general ledger will flow to the project. These expenses can be rebilled or simply recorded so I can measure project profitability. I'll demonstrate the process using the transactions contained in this Excel spreadsheet. This project matches the template that I already created. The first step is to activate project and tasks so I can enter time and expenses. In a separate browser, I will log in as an employee to submit a time card associated with the project estimate task. These hours will be recorded but not rebilled since this task has a fixed price. Once entered, the time card has to be approved and released. I'll speed up the video during this process. Now I can return to my project and see that costs are logged against my project. After providing an estimate to my client, I mark the first task as completed. This will trigger the billing for this task. Project costs can be allocated to various accounts. The formulas for this are very flexible and can include rate tables, attributes, and complex mathematical formulas. After running my allocation, I can return to my project budget, view the changes, and run project billing. Project allocations and billing can be scheduled to occur automatically. After billing is complete, I can review and release my invoice. By releasing my invoice, the revenue associated with my project is recorded in my general ledger and included in company reports. For the next phase of this project, I'll return to my employee account to enter another timesheet as well as an expense report. In this case, I will not show the process of approving and releasing these items. I also receive a third-party invoice for work performed on this project. I enter the invoice into my Accounts Payable module and link the expenses to my project and task. If necessary, each line item on my invoice can be linked to a different project or task. When I return to my project, I can see that my new costs are reflected in my project balance sheet. Since many of these expenses will be rebilled, I run my allocation in order to compute the proper billing amount. In this case, my expenses and subcontractor invoices are marked up while my labor expenses are rebilled at a different rate. Once my allocation is complete, I can run project billing for the next month and see that my items have been marked up and invoiced to the client. Reporting information is immediately available. All reports, such as this one showing employee hours and billable hours, are updated in real time as transactions are released to the project. When my project is over, I mark it as completed. This prevents new timesheets, expense reports, and invoices from being entered against this project. For more information about Acumatica, visit our website to read documentation and view other videos.